Hi, I'm Matt Russell with Synergy Consulting and Local Hop, two companies based here in Pontiac, Michigan. Synergy is an IT consultancy focused on building applications, managing cloud infrastructure, and, and really trying to optimize the business processes that you've got for your company and, and really creating it in a way that is highly usable for your, your internal employees as well as your clients and customers. Local Hop is our community focused events management platform. Um, we recently went through a website redesign for both our companies and we wanted to share some of the lessons learned from both. Websites, as, as you know and probably have painfully struggled with, are essential to the digital marketing and branding of your company today. Marketing has changed over the last 20 years and websites are really an introduction into who you are, what your company is about, your personality, your tone and your story for, for any company. So as we were going through this, we really had to look internally at ourselves and, and we had a few good lessons that we want to share today. Um, first and foremost, why would you look at building a new website? Are there pain points that you're trying to solve? Is there some message that's missing? Has the market shifted? It's really important to get your team on the same page with why are we even going to go about trying to do a website redesign? Second is, what is it that you're trying to convey? Are you looking for, or what is it that you're trying to build? Is it something that's basic? Is it something that's just a quick landing page? Is it something that's more full-fledged, like an e-commerce site? And are you trying to get your clients or, or patrons engaged and to stick on the page for a long time? Addressing the full scope of what you're trying to build is important so that you can have clear communications with the team that's going to build it for you. Next um, would be, how are you going to build it? Are you going to use a, a low code platform, something like a Wix that you can go out and just do yourself? Or are you going to hire a company or do it internally where you're building a full platform that you can expand on and, and live and breathe with in the future? There's different costs and, and pros and cons that come with, with all of them. Last, um, how are you going to measure what you've actually built? Are you going to get some input from your team, from a board, from a, a user group or client base? Um, you need some way to measure it. And we like to say that your first launch is never going to be your last launch. They're probably going to give you some feedback and allow you to learn and grow and build on that from there. And you need to be ready to handle that too. So as you go forward with this, just looking at those basic questions, give a framework that you can use to scope something out and go into realistic conversations that can help you shape your budget, your scope and your time frame. So these are things that we really, even though we do this day in and day out, when it came to us, we had to really rethink these and look at them and it was a good chance for us to re-examine that. So hopefully these are some useful tips. If you have any other questions, feel free to give us a shout. Thanks.